Hey, hello, how do you do? Shady Durex here. So a bit of an update for you guys. During December, I took a vacation. Uh, that's why there was a good couple of weeks with no content coming on the channel. I am back now and I'm making videos. However, the BoJack Horseman series finale is just around the corner and I'm working on a lot of videos for that. So in order to not uh, lose my momentum on those videos, I'm gonna be coming out with short, non-scripted videos from this point until that point. Uh, so that way there's still content coming out on the channel, but it's I don't lose the flow of what I'm doing um, For today's video. I wanted to talk about the new guy phenomenon that happened recently for those of you who don't know what I'm talking about There was this comic released about this purple hair girl who was laughing at uh, somebody who got robbed online She's essentially talking about PewDiePie who got who had his Japanese house robbed um, and uh, in the comic there's this new guy coming to her asking her how she would feel if she got robbed um, and she makes fun of him and says like treats him like an idiot essentially now if you know nothing about this comic and you're reading this for the first time who do you think is supposed to be the villain in this comic or the the person that we root against in this comic if your answer is the girl with evil colors, pointed glasses, an evil laugh, and a very, very mean attitude, you are wrong. We're not supposed to be rooting against her in this comic. New guy is supposed to be the idiot that we laugh at in this comic. Um, that was the writer's intended purpose, anyway. The girl is actually the writer's avatar, as far as I can figure, uh, representing herself. But the internet did not agree with the author. This is a serious case of uh, the death of the author. The internet took this by storm and began making memes about New Guy and this girl, seeing New Guy as this great hero uh, of the, the face that we need to, to look at as we go into 2020. And I absolutely understand where the internet is coming from with this one. Uh, first of all, like I said, or like I kind of mentioned earlier, the design of just how this comic is structured is very is done very poorly if you're supposed to root against New Guy. Uh, the girl is designed to have sharp angles on her glasses. Her colors are cold, and she's got she's got an evil look and an evil laugh. Like this is, regardless of the message. This was just a comic that wasn't done very well. It wasn't portrayed very well. People are going to think anyone designed this way is the villain. Uh, whereas New Guy, he's designed in a round fashion. He's designed to be very cuddly and, and warm looking. Uh, you can make bit, big people look menacing. Uh, off the top of my head, there's an example from Jack 2, the, a menacing big guy. But you can't just, the way that it's done here in this comic, he looks more like Baymax, and Baymax was designed to be cuddly. Um, so, but I wanted to say that this whole situation really stuck out to me because, as I've said on my channel before, um, the, the reason I start, or one of the driving forces behind me doing this channel is to spread empathy. Originally, it was just empathy between creators. You know, I was a programmer, but I was also an artist, and I noticed most programmers and artists didn't get along. And I thought I could, you know, help spread that awareness. Um, but since I started this channel, I've noticed that there is a severe lack of empathy in certain groups in the world, and it it became discouraging that people would view the world like this. That they would see somebody like a, a rich guy getting robbed and say, ha ha, they were a jerk or they're rich, so they they deserve it. And then when somebody comes up to them and says, how would you feel that happened to you? They don't address the argument. They just dismiss it with, you're dumb, or hey, he's, he's not me, so it doesn't matter. Um, empathy, I think, is one of the most important emotions for a human to have because it allows us to connect with one another and connections with one another has made uh, humanity go a very, very long way. Uh, if you go back to the days where it's us versus them, we would not have made nearly as much progress. Um, and the reason why this stuck out to me so much is because I, it really brought me joy to see that the internet as a whole 
kind of agrees with me on this, that new guy is actually the example we need to be going for. Uh, just because you don't like somebody or you're against somebody, it doesn't mean you should be devoid of trying to see things from their perspective. It doesn't mean you're going to agree with them. It doesn't mean that after you do it, you're not going to think they don't deserve to be punished. But when you refuse to even answer that question, uh, how would you feel if you were in that position? You show more wickedness about yourself than you do other people. Uh, this is why I made the uh, the controversial Tuca and Birdie video, and it's why I still stand by that video. You can't just have empathy for people you agree with or people who you think are good. You have It needs to be an objective empathy for all. Now, obviously, there's going to be moments where you're not going to it's not going to be appropriate to have empathy. You know, somebody comes up and punches you in the face. That is not the time to start asking, hmm, why did you do that? You know, you, you need to get up and defend yourself. And if somebody does something wrong to you, it'll probably take some time for you to come to a point where you can stop and have empathy. But I've seen too many people who believe that you need to put your foot down when some certain circumstance happens and just punish anyone who you think deserves it um and personally i don't like going that route i understand punishment but i don't like jumping the gun on punishment without any empathy whatsoever so i, I just wanted to say i completely understand what why the internet um why the internet sided with new guy and i completely agree with it i, I think for I, I think for everybody we should try to have empathy even for uh even for Purple Girl here, I think we should try to see things from her side and see maybe whether or not she is correct in her point of view. Um, but again, that doesn't mean that you have to agree or like or anything else that's nice to the person. It just means you should stop and look. Um, in a world where nobody looks at the other person's point of view, nobody's going to figure out what is actually the right point of view. They're only going to believe themselves. They're never going to admit they're wrong. Anyway, I could go on a tangent about this, but I'm going to stop there. I think you guys get the point of it. Um, so those are my thoughts on new guy. Just wanted to put them out there. And I'll see you guys in whatever video I release next. This has been Shady Durags. So long. Farewell. Avidasen. Goodbye.